Well, hey everyone, this is Mr. Pearson, and we are going to talk about lines. So in order to understand geometry and geometry shapes, it's important that we know and understand the parts that make up those shapes. And those parts have different names. We call them points, lines, line segments, and rays. Now the first one that you should know is a point. And a point is really easy to remember because it's just a location in space. A point can be anywhere. Now it doesn't have a length or a height, doesn't have a size or a shape. And essentially a point just marks the beginning drawing of a shape. And when we think of a point, we represent it with a dot and we name it with a capital letter. It can be any capital letter you want as long as that one hasn't been used before. So in this example, you can see on the screen, we have point A. The next one is called a line. And a line is a straight path of points. So all the points that are lined up in a straight path is called a line. And a line goes on and on forever in two opposite directions. They go, one goes to the right, one goes to the left, one goes up, one goes down, so on. They, the points always go in the opposite direction. And there are no end points. We'll talk about an end point here in a second. But there are no end points in a line. It just keeps going on forever. A good example of this is if you've ever been driving, you're riding in the backseat of the car, your mom or dad is driving somewhere or a grown-up's taking you someplace, and you look out and you see those white lines along the side of the road. That's an example of a line because it just goes in a straight line forever. Now when we think of a line, we usually name it by the two points that we can see. So in this example, we have point A from our previous one, and we also have point C. Now in the middle there, there's probably point B, we didn't label it, and it'll keep going, you'll see point D and point E and so on, because a line goes on forever in two different directions, two opposite directions. We also have something called a line segment. And a line segment is a straight path of points that actually has two endpoints. So it has a starting point and a stopping point. And it's just a piece of a line. Uh, a good example of this is, again, go back to when you're riding in the back seat of the car and you're looking out the window. If you look down the center of the road, oftentimes you'll see a dashed line. Well, each of those dashed, each of those dashes can be considered a line segment because it's part of a line. And a line segment goes from one point to another point, and then it stops. It's over. So you can see here in our example, we have point A, which is the start, and it goes to point C, and then it stops. That's the end of that line segment. And then the last one that you should know, we had point, we had line, we had line segment. The last one that's going to come into play is called a ray. And a ray, just like all of the others, is a straight path of points that goes on forever, but only in one direction. So a ray is a part of a line, like a line segment, and it's also like a line because it goes on and on in one direction. A line goes on and on in two directions. A ray is going to go on and on in just one direction. So a ray has a starting point, but it doesn't have an ending point. There's usually one end point and the other end goes on forever in one direction. Now these points, these things that we just discussed, the point, the line, the line segment, and the ray, they're all going to come into play when we start to talk about shapes when we start to talk about angles, when we learn about those things, you'll see lines and line segments and rays and points all come back in as we begin to discuss those things. So it's very important that you know that a point is a fixed position in space that can be all over the place. A line is a straight path of points that goes on and on in two opposite directions. A ray has a starting point and it goes on in one direction and then a line segment 
is just a piece of a line. It goes from one point to another point, and then it stops. Well, again, my name is Mr. Pearson, and I hope that you enjoyed learning about these things. We'll see you next time. Thank you.